Well, Homer in many ways created the modern community foundation field. He really saw that community foundations could have an agenda, could be activists, could really try to make change, as opposed to just responding to random requests that came in. He convinced Ford Foundation that community foundations were underused and got Ford to put money into three community foundations, including Cleveland. That was before he was in Cleveland. When the foundation was looking for a new director, um, having had the experience with the Ford partnership, Homer just appeared on everyone's wish list. He was getting close to retirement, so nobody knew whether they could convince him to come here at age 60. But he agreed to come and give us 10 years and really had a very amazing 10 years here at the foundation. He aspired to do big and important things and saw the foundation as important to doing big and inspired things. I keep running into people who talk about um, Homer and the impact he had. We wouldn't have Playhouse Square like it is today. We w wouldn't have North Coast Harbor. Um, it's not clear whether the city could have gotten out of default. It's very hard to imagine the Cleveland Foundation of today without the Homer Wadsworth years in the middle. Um, he took a, an important institution that was growing and changing and really pushed it to a leadership role and to um, an institution that really saw a potential to provide significant civic leadership.